morning, everyone. Morning. I'm, I'm pleased to have been given the honorary doctorate on the floor. <laughs> it's an honor I take without any hesitation. Um, on behalf of our Secretary General, Ambassador Erin Larocque, I first want to extend our deepest and sincere gratitude to the government and people of Belize. I often joke that this is my home away from home. And when I came out of the plane at the airport, I, that was solidified even more, the level of hospitality that was given. And Minister, um, you have a great team led by the CEO. We want to express our deepest gratitude Minister with Responsibility for Agriculture, Belize, um, Honorable Holtz. Minister with Responsibility for Agriculture, Antigua and Barbuda, Honorable Minister Jonas. Sub-Regional Coordinator, Coordinator for the FAO, Dr. Renata Clark, Head of Delegation for ECA, Dr. Beverly West, team lead for the CTA, Dr. Ben Adu. I want to publicly express our gratitude from the region and in, in particular the Secretariat for the support and tremendous support that you have given to us to be able to put on this planners forum and by extension the week of agricultural activities. I know we are accustomed to having the Caribbean Week of Agriculture, but because of circumstances beyond anybody's control, we're not having that this week. But the gathering that we are having it today, I, I dare say will suffice, or the week will suffice for the absence of same. I want to also extend welcome to the member states who are here and the ones who are on their way, because without your participation, then it would not be possible. We have been deliberate in our actions for the planners, for this 12th planners forum. It's one that moves away from just talking. It is one that deals with participation, inclusion, and also discussion with, with the aim of demonstrating and adopting practical workable solution. And the two entities that we have targeted are private sector and the public sector. The intention is to move away from heavy regulation to business facilitation because the ultimate objective is for economic development and re regional integration. And what does it best? There has to be some economic activities that is going on and that can benefit our people. Because at the end of the day, the question we ask how is it that our member states are benefiting from this union that we have? And as a secretariat, it's our responsibility to coordinate in a manner that makes it work. And not only work from the political level, but from the very micro level, which is the homes of our, our people. And when that is reflected in their daily lives, then the union becomes even stronger. But with that said, um, we've, we invited a presenter, but unfortunately he got some very sad news this morning at breakfast that his mother passed. So unfortunately, um, Ravi Sankar from Caribbean Flavors, he has had to leave us. So I want to ex ex extend and express our condolences to him and his family in this time of this challenging times. I mean, you could just imagine being away and getting news like that. And he did consent to leave his business, leave his time, to come and share with us. So I just want to publicly say that um, I would dare say on behalf of the entire region and the gathering here that we are with him and we offer our prayers and support. Um, it's not for me to talk, but just to say thank you. I think we're going to have an exciting week, exciting session. And not that I'm a magician or a what you call people predict, psychic. But I think everybody will leave with the necessary fulfillment, new ideas, 
new thoughts that we can take back to our countries and implement. And I dare say, if we want to resign and open our own businesses, we would have met the intended objective. So I say thank you all, and do participate, and have a great week, and a great planners forum, and accompanying meetings. Thank you.